Now, this is the part of the show I genuinely don't know anything about. There's going to be a mystery guest who's been in the news, and I have to figure out who that person is. So, please welcome my mystery guest. <laughs> How are you? Oh shit. Hi, <laughs> Michelle. Thanks, man. Hello. Nice to meet you. I'm Russell. What's your name? My name's Colin. Furs. Colin. Excellent. Colin Furs. Uh, nice to meet you. What's all this? Explain these contraptions here. Uh, this is uh, supposed to be my workshop. Right. Sort of thing. Do you know, I know who you are straight away. Literally, I know exactly who you are. That's you, you're the James Bond guy, aren't you? I am, yes. Fucking right. <laughs> I'm not here for all that. Oh, all right, okay. So, there's another the, reason. But last year, didn't you invent a uh, motorbike that fires... Uh, did you explain to everyone what it did? I thought it'd be a good idea to put a... Oh, I know what it is! I know why you're in the news! <laughs> <laughs> I know why you're in the news, and it's a pleasure to meet you. This man, correct me if I'm wrong, made a shop mobility scooter go at 69 miles an hour. Exactly. What a thing to do! <laughs> I can show it if you want. Have you got it here? I Sweet. certainly have. Oh, great, let's have a look. You had me at disability scooter. <laughs> Colin, bring out the beast. Wait a minute, we're having a technical problem. <laughs> what is the technical problem, Colin? Just, just keep entertaining, I'll be with you in a minute. <laughs> Just a minute. Okay. <laughs> it's like a live version of Wallace and Gromit. <laughs> Colin, what made you decide that you wanted pensioners to travel as fast as they could? Um, I don't know. <laughs> Colin, have you ever made love on your shop mobility scooter? <laughs> but there's a first for everything. <laughs> Oh, OK, cool. Yeah. So, is it broken now? Uh, well, sort of, yeah. Can, can I have a go on it? You, can, allowed? Sit, you can sit on it, yeah. But I actually want to... I want to go fast. You want to... <laughs> That's not as good, is it? Yeah, I'll, I'll push you. That's not the same. <laughs> push me for a bit, so I sort of know... I've got to put it in neutral now. Sweet. <laughs> right. Let's have a push it. Come on, Russell. Thank you. <laughs> Just for the shots, dear. Oh, I'll tell you what, mate, that feels good. No, we do actually have some video of this working, I do believe, to kind of rescue my reputation. OK, let's have a look at that. <laughs> Well, broke the, what was the record you broke? Well, there wasn't a record because nobody's done it before. But uh, <laughs> Guinness said that only. Of course, nobody's done it before. <laughs> <laughs> but Guinness said that only accept it if I got above 61.4, which is 100 kilometres an hour. But Wouldn't it be lovely if there's an old lady at home who just kind of goes, "I'll beat that." Yeah. <laughs> but what's next? What's next? I haven't flown yet. Right. And I haven't conquered the water. <laughs> nice to <so>. say. <laughs> Conquered the war. <laughs> oh my god, people don't say that often enough, do they? <laughs> nice to meet you, Colin. It's a genuine pleasure. Too, Ladies right. and gentlemen, give it up for my <laughs> <laughs>